Hey there, it's Dana, lavishly living life out loud. And I want to talk to you today about a piece of fashion, actually two pieces of fashion. We're going to take a look at North Face and Free Country. I'm not completely pleased with either one. However, I will say the North Face is faring so much better in the cold weather. So let's take a look at the two products and see if we can determine why one is working better than the other. This is Free Country. As you can see, these are what it is made of, the 100% nylon, okay? And we're going to take a look at the North Face, which is the purple one, and you're going to see it's made of the same thing. Okay, so I purchased two jackets out of curiosity, and I wanted to see what the difference was. One I paid $19.99 for. And that was at one of the big warehouse clubs. And the other, of course, is the North Face, and I paid $200 for. The thing that I love about my North Face is the warmth and that it keeps all the wetness off of my body, even if it's raining. Um, though it's not meant to be a jacket for wet, it does shield you from the snow, and there is no moisture that has come through. It has zipper pockets, it fits tight to the body, it is thermoball, but it's lacking a hood. So whenever I saw this coat, I said, oh, let's see why this might be $19.99, is it as warm? Well, this has a hood, which I really appreciate about the jacket, but what it doesn't offer is a whole lot of warmth. It again fits nice to the body, it has a generous cut just as the North Face, However, when it was raining, and I'm not quite sure what the deal is, when it was raining and actually it was sleet, not even rain, I was getting wet on my arms and I could feel it coming between the seams. So the seaming and the stitching does not seem to be as tight. This jacket really is not keeping me warm. It's just basically a shield over the body, not doing much else. This, however, is keeping me warm. So when I look at the price comparison and I actually did the trial run and wore them both, I'm again going to pick, of course, the North Face as I lavishly live life out loud in fashion. I love the North Face. Not so crazy about this brand, this run through. Sometimes they do offer some nice clothing. This just isn't one that's going to win with me for this particular type of clothing. So again, this is my Thermo Ball. It's nice and warm. It's North Face purple, slim to, slim to wear, stays nice to the body, but it does lack a hood. This is Dana, lavishly living life out loud.